Hello everyone. Today I thought what we would do today is to do a side-by-side -side of a 2014 Chrysler 200 and a 2015 Chrysler 200. Just so you can kind of see the differences between the two vehicles. Let's start off with the 14. This is just a 2014 Chrysler 200 LX. It has a 2.4 liter four cylinder engine in it. it has a six speed automatic transmission. Kind of give you a brief view. Then we got the 2015 Chrysler 200. It is also powered by the 2.4 liter multi-air engine. This vehicle has a nine speed automatic transmission. It's roughly the same trim level as the 14. However, in the white one, the new one, you can see it actually has the aluminum wheels on it. They are the 235-45R18s, so they're 18 inch. All 200s come standard with keyless enter and go. It is a smart key system. They also have push button start. It's a, it's a, a huge change between the two vehicles, but you can kind of see some design influences between the two, so it's even though it's a humongous change, they still look kind of familiar. The older 200s also had the LED lighting with the projector beams. The new ones also have the LED lighting here that run down this way, and there's still projector beams as well. The chrome accents around the lower air dams. All right, so look on the inside of the 2014 200. They have improved the interior over what the seat ring was. Fit and finish is a lot better. Um, soft touch dash top instead of plastic. This particular vehicle has doesn't have a trip computer. It does have cruise control. Uh, this vehicle has 12,870 miles on it. Interior has the panel black finish, analog clock. The single disc CD player does not have Uconnect. Manual air conditioning. The automatic transmission, illuminated cup holders. In the back seat, seating for three across, integrated headrest, fold down center armrest with integrated cup holders. Also has a trunk pass through. The cloth is real soft and pretty luxurious. It's not too bad for a cloth interior. I like leather personally, but the cloth here is a, is a good quality cloth. All right, so we're gonna look at the new 200. This vehicle has the tan cloth. Standard is an eight-way power driver seat with four-way adjustable lumbar. The 2014 just has uh, manual seats, automatic headlamps. Also has a driver knee airbag. This vehicle does have an integrated trip computer. It also has integrated Bluetooth and Uconnect cruise control. It does have automatic climate control. It has a 9-speed automatic transmission with the rotary e-shift, electronic parking brake. The center console, excuse the keys I have in here, uh, it is a nice one. It slides in, reveals uh, all of your data ports. You have, it's kind of hard to see, I don't have a light. Uh, USB port here, you have your auxiliary input here, and then you have a 12-volt power outlet here not to mention the storage. Also what's handy is you have a pass-through that's right here. You can kind of see, um, what it does is it passes through this floating center console. This is actually really nice and it was because of the no linkages that they were able to do this. So you can charge your devices underneath here and have them out of the way.
Your center armrest also folds up to reveal even more storage. It's illuminated as well. The console armrest also slides forward. Standard also is a Uconnect 5.0 touchscreen display. You have your Uconnect rear view mirror with integrated microphones, overhead storage. All right, so in the back seat of the 2015 200, you have integrated cup holders in the door panel. Allows them before seating three across. It is cloth again. Fold down center armrest, cup holders, and it has a storage compartment, which the 14 does not. It also has a trunk pass through as well. You do have a small center storage tray here as well. All right, this does about conclude our quick look at the differences between the 2015 200 and the 2014 200. If you have any questions or would like to see either of these two vehicles, please contact our showroom. One of our friendly sales staff will be more than happy to answer any questions that you may have. And as always, thanks for watching.